A common pattern in TypeScript is to create type helpers that allow you to extract kind of types from uh, things that are not types. Here, we've created a, crop, a props from type helper, which extracts kind of a component. So if I call this T component here, and currently what we wanted to do is we wanted to return the props. Here, it would return enabled Boolean if we put it, if put my component in there. So let's see how we do that. If we go T component uh, extends a react.fc, which is a functional component, then we can actually add a generic there and we can say, um, infer the props and then we can return the props and otherwise because this is a ternary it needs to uh, return something we say never and now props props from this is going to return enabled boolean because if i change this up here to a for instance just say it's true and i add false here then that's going to fail because it's expecting uh true but what if you need two different um like you want to be able to feed in two different types of things into this helper then you need to kind of add an extra layer to the ternary. So let's imagine that uh, we had a my, com uh, my other components here uh, because React components can be um, added as classes too. So here what we do is we say, um, instead of this, T component extends React component, uh, then we return props, and then we have never. And now we can say props from is basically like, uh, why is this not working? Boolean is not returned to site never, so we can say components instead. So this now is uh, working both with React functional components, which you see here, and with React components declared as classes.